Hey guys, welcome to this next Counter-Strike Source tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create an auto-exec file. Basically what an auto-exec file does is it executes a bunch of commands when you set up your game. Like for instance if you want your crosshair skill locked um, to a certain number, um, if you want your FPS max to a certain number, you know, stuff like that. Any console command you can put in uh, your console and game you can put in this text file. So to create one you need to uh, open up notepad and from here you can type in the commands that you want enforced I'm gonna show you three different kinds uh, these are regular um, commands that you normally use right here I'm gonna show you how to show you the rates CL, CMD rate, update rate and oh, rate 35,000 okay so those are like rates so you can do rates um, if you want your zoom sensitivity ratio locked actually I'm going to take the space out here ratio 0 0.9 and um, you can do that you can do your regular um, commands like that you can also do binds for instance if I want uh, the letter P when I press it to uh, say in chat that you suck I can put that in there um, and finally if you want to execute a file you can do exec and then the name so exec space FPS in this case uh, from here I want to go to file save as and then you want to navigate to uh, your CFG folder so you need to click on program files go to steam steam apps your Steam account name, Counter Strike Source, C Strike, and CFG. Now, this is really important. You want to name it Auto Exec A U T O E X E C dot CFG, and you want to make sure um, CFG is capitalized because if it's not capitalized, it creates a text file with this icon right here. You'll see it's a little uh, piece of paper with the corner folded over. If you um, if this is what it looks like you didn't do it right because um, the file won't execute when you set up your name with this icon you want it to have the notepad name and I'm going to show you what that looks like right now so autoexec.cfg cfg must be capitalized and click save and you can exit out of this now you need to navigate to your steam folder again so go to local disk uh, program files steam again steam apps your Steam name folder, Counter Strike Source, C Strike, and CFG. And you'll see that Auto Exec has this piece of paper, or this white thing with uh, a notepad in the middle of it, just like these uh, config files right here do. So you can always open it up and add more commands, just make sure you uh, exit out and click save. But I'm going to explain what these commands do, because uh, especially this Exec FPS one. So CLCMD rate 66 is a rate command. Update rate 66 is rate, and rate is obviously a rate command as well. Zoom sensitivity ratio is uh, my zoom sensitivity ratio. <laughs> and then bind P, say you suck, means that when I hit P, it's going to say in chat, you suck to the other team, or to the whole server. Um, for instance, if you also, if you want to say uh, you suck, to a, to your team, you just have to do say underscore team like that, but it doesn't really make a difference. And then finally, exec FPS means uh, execute FPS. And as you can see, I have a file here called FPS. And if you open it up, or if I open it up, you'll see that's an FPS config uh, that I like to use. It kind of cleans up the game, and I much prefer it. Uh, I much prefer it over the default look of the game because I think it just looks dirty and cluttered and stuff uh, with too much detail. Um, but yeah, that's all you have to do. And, uh, create an auto exec file. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. And if you have any questions on specifics that you want to know uh, or anything gone over in more detail, feel free to drop me a comment below or send me a PM and I'll get to it as soon as I can. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe for more videos. And I'll see you next time.